Hi guys, I'm Pia Wurzbach and welcome to the very first episode of Dear David. Kung saan sasagutin namin lahat ng mga tanong nyo tungkol sa beauty, hairdressing, and many more. But for this episode, we'll be talking about hair and makeup first. With me today is the CEO of David Salon, Mr. David Charlton, to help us answer your questions. Hi, Mr. David. Hi, Pia. So with me are some questions and maybe you can help me answer them. That would be my pleasure. Okay. Um, Ricky Go writes, I would like to ask about the curriculum you're offering under the hair and makeup course. Well, Ricky, our basic curriculum is uh, skin analysis and bone structure analysis. So we'll teach you what kind of makeup to use and which parts of your face, of course. And also, of course, it's day makeup and evening makeup, which of course are two different styles. We will teach you that. And for the hairdressing, we will teach you the chignon, braiding, French twist, petals, and a few other styles as well that we can throw in there depending on the model that you bring with you. So by the time you're finished the basic course, you will have a pretty much, well, a basic idea on how to do nice makeup for day wear, nice makeup for evening wear, and some great hairstyles as well. So when you have those special gimmicks with your friends, you can fix their hair for them as well. Oh, well. That's uh, very useful. I might try that. You should. <laughs> okay. Um, Alali Camille Pineda Nodado and Christine Fezita says, Hi, good morning. I want to ask if you're offering a home service for hair and makeup for a graduating student. Uh, yes, we can do that. It must be booked in advance, but yes, we can, depending on how many people you are and whereabouts you are. You would really need to talk to our local salons for that. Or what you can do is call 897 4247 which is our trunk line and we can put you in touch with the salon in your area so that we can organize that for you and of course our prices are very reasonable okay great so Lisa Lynn Rubio writes hi good morning itatanong ko lang kung ano oras nagbubukas ang David Salon well of course we have branches all over the country so they open up at different times most of our mall branches, of course, will open up the same time as the malls, which is usually about 10 o'clock in the morning. Of course, special holidays, it can be lunchtime or uh, earlier sometimes even. Uh, some of our salons that are outside of the malls open as early as 8 o'clock in the morning or 9 o'clock in the morning. Check with your local branch. After 10 a.m., no matter where you go, you should be pretty sure that we're open. Last one here is Wendy Uilong asks, Hello, gusto ko lang magpa-inquire, how much magpa-hair and makeup? Our basic hair and makeup starts at 1,200. Now that's guaranteed to make you beautiful. Even though we say it's basic, you're guaranteed to look beautiful. And our airbrush makeup starts at 2,500. Airbrush makeup will give you a nice smoother finish and make you even more beautiful. So if you've got the time and you've got the money, go for the airbrush makeup. But check which branch you're going to because not all of our branches have the airbrush makeup. Anyhow, basic hair and makeup is going to make you gorgeous. Well, thank you very much, Mr. David. And thank you too, P. You're doing a wonderful job. Thank you. And because it's our very first episode, very special din ang mga guests natin. Kasama ko ngayon are my fellow Binibini Pilipinas 2015 winners who will be demonstrating the looks for this episode. Archie with Kim Valin Souza, second runner-up in the Binibini Filipinas. Mr. JP and his model, Hannah Sisson, first runner-up in the Bindi Binning Filipinas. Mr. JM and his model, Rogeli Katakutan, Miss Supranational in the Bindi Binning Filipinas. Mr. KC and his model, Christy, Miss Intercontinental in the Bindi Binning Filipinas. Mr. Marlowe and his model, Anne Collis, Miss Tourism in the Bindi Binning Filipinas. Miss Maquette and her model, Janicelle Lubina, Miss International in the Bindi Binning Filipinas. Mr. Louis with Pia Wurzbach, Miss Universe in the Bindi Binning Filipinas. We instructed our stylists to apply hair and makeup to our Bini Binning Filipinas winners, including our host, Miss Universe, Philippines 2015, Pia Wurzbach. The process took around one to one and a half hours.
everyone, kasama ko ngayon yung mga fellow Binibini Pilipinas 2015 winners. At kukunin natin yung mga reactions ng bawat isa dahil sa transformation natin ngayon. Ako masayang masaya ako sa hairstyle ko ngayon. Kasi from the Binibini 2014, ang hair ko lagi naka-up. So ngayon, batch na to, nagaroon kami with the hairstyle, lugay, straight, kulot. So I'm really very happy. Pati din sa makeup, medyo nag-experiment din ng konti para makita ko ano yung mas bagay compared to last year. And... Of course, I'm very happy naman dahil collab collaboration naman to with my stylist ang Davids and then sa side din natin, of course. Tsaka ang ganda rin naman, di ba, ng kinalabasan oh, na kahit oh. na iba siya, yes. bagay pa rin yeah, naman. Oh, oh, fresh, fresh. <laughs> <laughs> Ikaw, ah, napansin ko kasi palaging straight hair yung peg mo, pero this time, tinry naman natin yung naka-curl na one side. Yeah, David Salon loves to try something new, di ba? So, mm -hmm. uh, ako kasi I have that signature look na lagi akong straight, ganyan. And then, With my stylist, uh, Mama Maquette from David Salon, uh, tinryan niya naman yung kulot sa akin and I love it. I love my new look. Uh, at least ngayon na uh, medyo iba yung look ko ngayon from the coronation night. Oo nga, actually. So, girls, kayo. Uh, uh -huh. Ako naman, uh, I love my looks today because mm -hmm. especially my hair, it creates the illusion na mas I'm taller, I became more taller and I love my lips. Actually, I love dark lipstick because I feel so mestiza. And I'm more confident wearing this lipstick. How about you? I'm actually me also. Like the other girls, my hairstyle tonight is different from Coronation. Because before, my hair is usually parted to get and now it's always been up. And now you see how long my hair actually is. So. Thank you for providing something new for me, David. And um, what about you, Hannah? Um, for me, naman, um, my stylist likes to play then with my hair. And usually, kasi my hair is just curly or straight with no teeth, and it's very flat. So right now, talagang todo teeth ang ginawa niya. Maganda. Ang pinakita yung mukha ko, kasi usually minsan natatago ng hair ko. And I also like my makeup, kasi usually without makeup, masyado akong pa-sweet, masyado akong pa-girl. So, talagang tinapangan niya yung sa mata, parang mukha akong fierce. Ay, gusto ko yan. Ikaw, Rogeli, nung coronation night, parang nakataas yung buhok mo, di ba? Yeah, yeah. Actually, ako yung pinakamadam dito since nung kapatid. Pero now, ang tinay namin na mag one side, tsaka ikaw dito sa ilalim. So, parang na-pull off din naman. And then, ako kasi, when it comes to my makeup, I'm a little bit chinita. So, kailangan talaga palikihin yung mata ko. So, kita-kita naman. Eyeliner, ba? Maganda, maganda. So, thank you so much, kina um, JM at JP and everyone who helps sa paggawa ng napakaganda ng makeup namin. And Madam P, how about you? <laughs> so tingin ko kasi um binabagayan din siguro yan sa gown na suot mo ganyan. Mm -hmm. And dito sa gown na to, na try ko na mag straight, na try ko na mag kulot, <laughs> itaas ngayon para naka half pony siya. Ang gusto ko is pwede ako mag-open up doon sa stylist ko na si Sir Louie na kung ano ba yung sana ko comfortable, kung ano yung maganda. Mm -hmm. Kung ano yung maganda na ikita ko sa salamin at titingnan din niya kung ano yung magandang tingnan on stage. So, nakakatuwa kasi very open and hindi ka mahihiyang magsabi kung ano yung gusto mo at um, kung ano yung comp mas comfortable yes. ka. And there you have it! Narinig na natin mismo sa mga Binibining Pilipinas 2015 winners yung mga testimonials nila about the experience at David Salon. Kaya kung ako sa inyo, visit your nearest David Salon branch to have the same beauty queen experience. Again, this has been Pia Wurzbach and I'll see you guys next week for another episode of Dear David.